Hey folks, this is Gary with Barracudas, and today I'm gonna to show you a nice cherry trick. Every bartender should know a trick or two to help them engage with their customers and hopefully increase their tips a little bit. So here's how the trick works. We're gonna take three empty shaker tins and one, two, three cherries, okay? So we're gonna take the shaker tins, and place each shaker tin over the cherry. Put that cherry on top there. Snap our fingers, turn it into two. Snap our fingers, turn that into three. Last two shaker tins, put them on top. Snap our fingers, turn it into four cherries. There you have it, four cherries. Now, let's see if we can turn those four cherries into five. Take your shaker tins, Put it on top, snap our fingers. A lime. What happened to the cherry? Wait a second. And an orange. There you have it, folks. A simple trick any bartender should know and learn and practice and help you increase your tips. And here's how this trick works. What you're going to need is four shaker tins, an orange, a lime, and four cherries. The first thing you're going to do is take your orange and stuff it down as far as you can into one of the tins. Place the lime, just sit it on top. The lime needs to go below the rim of the top of the shaker tin. You're gonna put that down out of view of your customers. You now have four cherries. Take one of the cherries and simply wedge it between your pinky finger and your ring finger. And just close it so your audience can't see it. Now you begin the trick. You obviously show your audience the empty shaker tins. You put them back down. When you pick them up, you drop the cherry into one of the tins. I know it's now in that tin. So, when you begin the trick, it's the second tin I'm gonna spin. Spin the first one, put it down the cherry. Spin the second one, put it down, spin the third one. I now know there's two cherries underneath there. Look, I don't even have to look. So, continue on with the trick. You're gonna place the first cherry on the top, toss the tin behind your back, or just pick it up, whatever you choose. Click, and just like magic, there's two cherries, we already knew that. Spin the tin. Now there's a cherry in this tin. As you know, when you spin it, you have to be careful that the cherry doesn't come flying out. So you wanna catch it before the tin is completely upside down. Just like that. Now I know there's three cherries in there. Look. And just repeat it again. Spin the other tin, put it on top, click. Now we've got our three cherries. And just repeat it once more. Now I know there's four cherries, look. Take the other two tins, show your audience that they're empty, put them on top, click, and reveal the four cherries. Now, while the audience are in absolute amazement that you've turned three cherries into four, your sleight of hand is gonna drop the bottom tin into your well below and pick up the one with the limes and the orange very smoothly. I'm gonna do it right now to show you how quickly I do it. Four cherries. Right there, the orange and the lime are in there. You take your other two tins, you put them down. The audience doesn't know the orange and the lime are in there. You place your four cherries on top. You put your final two tins on top, click, and you lift it up. Now they're amazed at the lime instead of the four cherries. And then just to finish the trick for the cherry on the icing on the cake, there's your orange. It's that simple. Thank you for watching, folks. Visit HireBarracudasMore.com for more videos. See you later. Thank you for watching Secret of the Booze. Be sure to subscribe and watch past episodes. As always, if you have a geeky cocktail, let us know in the comments below.